It was so bad that the waiting room began cheering for each person who was called in and actually seen. In the end, I waited for more than two hours for the lab draw, for which I had an appointment and paid $19 for parking. Services provided by DynaLife has left many facing delays and cancellation, with the Alberta NDP classifying DynaLife's terms so far as a disaster and leading many to paying for a members-only clinic. The official opposition's leader, Rachel Notley, says there's evidence the government is now in conversations about buying the system back. After wasting tens of millions of Albertans' tax dollars or more to blow up the public lab, the UCP gave the whole thing to a private company who now wants taxpayers to buy it back from them. Meanwhile, even more importantly, regular Albertans are left with unacceptable wait times and frustrations. Meanwhile, Alberta Premier Danielle Smith says if a Calgary medical clinic begins charging a fee for faster access to a family doctor, it will be shut down, fined, or have Medicare payments from the province withheld. Smith says her government is committed to the principles of the Canada Health Act that include patients not paying to access publicly funded services such as doctor visits.